Okay, check. This is um, your first lesson. We're at uh, December 16th, or close to it. <laughs> okay, so uh, before we start recording, I was talking about the yellow lines we've drawn here are the swing plane lines, and I'm going to draw some additional lines that I'll explain. Okay, so we want one backboard. Plane. I want to. I like to trace your hand path, and we we do uh, see how much head movement. I draw on these lines. Okay. So back to the swing plane. The swing plane is is a a plane that's parallel to these yellow lines. It doesn't have to be on one or the other. And the reason that swing plane is important is is you take the club back, and then to hit, you have to get it back right there. Okay, so the more times the shaft leaves the swing plane, that's an unneeded movement, and requiring a compensating movement. So, so if I take the club back here, here's the swing plane. If I take it back here, then 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 I got to get a compensating movement that way, and you don't need either one of those movements. So, so the more movements we have, the more inconsistent we're going to be. Okay, so that that's the deal with the swing plane. So, so as we go back, so the, in general, you know, it's an athletic swing. Just the 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 uh, naked eye is the body movements going all over the map. Okay. I like, and we'll see, the swing plane is close, uh, your, your shaft is close to the swing plane, but here, here we'll go. So, so here's the takeaway, okay, so at, right away we're a little out of position, we're more than a little out of position. So at this point, we should Whoops. We should uh, we should be right here. See, he's got he's got this. Uh, whoops. <laughs> Well, you got the he got the idea, yeah. And and here, okay. So 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 basically, if if you spin in this Y and rotate your shoulders, it'll go right to that spot. But what happens here is you, you're every every good athlete is too handsy in the golf swing. To get it there, you got to go like this, okay. There's, there's nothing like this. The only thing your hands do is this. So it comes here and it rotates this way. When you come down, it releases this way. There's no spanking the baby, putting that thing back or anything else. So I'll give you a copy of this and you know, print it out and put it on the mirror. And all you do is duplicate you know, the left-handed Scott, uh, Adam Scott. Okay, so uh, we captured that. Let me do it again. Okay. Then, uh, so it's going to take it's going to take something for you to recover from this move, to be honest. So uh, let's get to the next position where the left arm or the front arm is parallel to the ground. See. There's a lot of good things with this. The bad thing is the heads move. Yeah, see, see, that's what I'm seeing with the naked eye. So, so the heads move this this far, like looks like forward three inches and down two or inch and a half. Okay. So, uh, and and that that front knee is is jetted out, and probably what you do is is we'll, we'll rotate around that. In reality, we want to rotate around your spine. Okay, so this, you know, uh, 
Sharon had a similar thing where that left knee was kicked out. Let me show you. Okay, so so you know your your uh, your stance is closed. Okay. So let me put this on pause. Okay, so we just went over the fact that your toe line is is closed. Now, we get to here, and we take it to the top, you know, look, I like the fact that it's still on plane, see that? I like the fact that that, that left arm is vertical, it's really good, okay, here I'll show you this guy's, see his, 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 uh, His arm is vertical for him. Okay, so back to you. You know this. this okay, so so this this knee thing is going to cause you some problem. I'll tell you right now. The, the concept is I got sidetracked. Sorry. The concept is you don't want the knee past the toe. It's kind of hard because you're you're so close. But okay, so watch this. So you get that knee way out. Right. So, so you have a you have a way out. Now you can't clear that front hip. That doesn't work that way. What happens is you just kind of come around like that. Okay. And 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 look, you leave the back wall. Okay. So so I like the top position except for the knee and the head movement. Then. From here, this this is see how you start on plane. This is really good. So this aspect is really good. Like people spend a lifetime. Look, it's right on your forearm. People spend a lifetime to get that on plane thing. Okay, but but the body, you know, the body is going crazy. I mean, you got to be Houdini to hit with with your body movement. So look, your your head head is. Is 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 uh, gone down, which is okay. And then watch as you turn. Yeah, see your butt comes away from the back wall. Oh, wow. Yeah. Now, now look, look at this guy. So when he comes down, see he rotates around his spine. Yeah. I haven't drawn. There's some camera movement, but you can figure that out. So. So when he goes back, yeah. see the camera move, but don't yeah. don't believe it. But see how that left right cheek kicks out. Yeah. Yours, and then when 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 the belt buckle goes to the ball, we have to lose our spine angle because if we kept that spine angle and the belt buckle went to the ball, you'd fall on your face, and that's part of why you're stumbling out of it yeah. some of the time. You're trying to keep the spine angle, but the belt buckle is going this way. So your lower body's going this way, and if you don't stand up, you you, you, you tumble out of it. That's why you're tumbling out of it. Okay. So so the idea is, you know, you get this this backward and the backswing. This hip pocket hits, and you come through this hip pocket. So you don't have to find ground as opposed to you here. And then you're away, yeah. and then you have to stand up, and then you yeah. have to throw your hands out. Yeah, Sharon mentioned that exercise too. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so so as you come down, but this is I'm telling you, this is so good. It's on plane, but but your base, your foundation is yeah. is waving and like a flag, and we gotta we gotta get it, you know, get. It, uh, uh, rotated around the spine. Okay, so, and then you know, the, the great news is when you come back to hit, your your head is about where it was, but you have all this this movement. And this turn through is good, except it's it's so far from the back wall. Yeah, yeah, I see that. Okay, so let me.